Hi everyone, this is Ravi. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. This is Postman Beginners Tutorial and this is our lesson 1 where I am going to introduce you to the latest version of the Postman tool and also I am going to teach you how can we download and install the latest version of the Postman from the official website of Postman. Please do subscribe to the channel, click on bell icon, you will receive notifications whenever I publish more videos. Thank you. So what is Postman? So it is an API client which, is, which will be used to send API requests from the Postman tool and you can perform basically you can develop the APIs by using Postman and also you can perform testing manually or by automating the test cases by using Postman tool and also you can share the projects that you developed in Postman and also you can document the APIs that you developed. It supports it supports both REST as well as SOAP requests and I'm going to teach you how can we download and install Postman desktop application from the official website and as I told you Postman is an API client if you see in the diagram this is your client and you are sending requests through network to one of the server that means from client the postman sends the API requests either it might be REST services request or SOAP requests through network to server so that's why we call it as postman so now let's jump onto the system and let me teach you all these concepts by using postman this is my Chrome browser so let me teach you how can we download latest version of the postman tool first okay so you just need to type postman download and then search so as soon as you search you can find first search result which is postman.com slash downloads you just need to click on that link and then here on the top you have sign up for free button you need to click on sign up for free button and then provide your email address and what is the user ID, username that you want to provide and then what is the password and then click on cre create free account as soon as you click on free account you are going to receive an email so let me show you what kind of email is going to you are going to receive so this is the email that you are going to receive with a welcome note to confirm your email so as soon as you click on confirm my, confirm my email your email will be confirmed okay and then once that is done let's go back to your a chrome browser okay you, you need to go back to your chrome browser and then click on sign in and then here you need to provide your username and provide your password and click on sign in so once you click on sign in where you can find a download option if you see at the bottom here at the bottom left corner there is an option for downloading the desktop application postman desktop application click on this and now if you see because my machine is windows machine windows machine it's recognizing me as a windows machine and then it is showing me a button to download my windows application you just click on that button as soon as you click on button your postman.exe file will be downloaded so i already downloaded that uh, downloaded my postman.exe file so let's go to my download downloads option and you need to run this setup file it's a straightforward you just double click and then follow the instructions provided by the postman ui simple just click on next 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 
So once that is done, you can see a icon, postman icon on your desktop. You need to click on that icon. As soon as you click on that icon, your postman application, desktop application will be opening. So once you open the desktop application, you need to click on sign in button to sign in. Okay, this is my postman where I have empty collections, APIs, environments. I'm going to explain all these concepts, how to create workspaces, how can you create uh, your collections, how can you create uh, API request SOAP and REST services, and then how can you test your APIs, right? All these things, how can you create environments, environment variables, all these things I'm going to explain you in the next upcoming sessions okay for now let's just sign in click on on top right corner click on sign in and provide your username and password so before that it's gonna when i click on sign in it's gonna open your browser to sign in you need to provide your username and then password and click on sign in as soon as you click on sign in it's gonna ask you to open your application okay so here if you see here your you're gonna your application postman application by default is gonna sign in because it's a single sign on as soon as you sign in to your browser your application also gets sign in okay desktop application so if you see this is my nice dashboard of my desktop application this is desktop application it's not web browser I have all the workspaces that are already created okay Be because you see for the first time when you sign in you won't see any workspaces okay so as I told you I'm gonna cover all the concepts very very important concepts of postman tool how can you use the postman tool to test soap services rest services and then how can you automate your soap and rest services automation concepts okay how can you create environment variables global variables i'm going to teach you all the concepts in the upcoming sessions please do subscribe to the channel click on bell icon you'll receive notifications whenever i publish more videos thank you